Apple continues to be ahead of Google in the OS adoption game to view the full article, click the first link in the description below. 92% of iPhones introduced in the last four years are running on iOS 13. If one had to compare this with Google, Read More in just over 48 hours, is set to unveil its next generation of software updates for all its devices at WWDC 2020. All eyes will be on 14 and what new features it will bring to the. Before iOS 14 is unveiled to the world, Apple has given numbers that indicate how many people in the world are on iOS 13. As per figures on the Apple developer webpage, 92% of iPhones introduced in the last four years are running on iOS 13. Only 7% of iPhones that have come out in the last four years are running iOS 12 whereas just 2% are on an older version of iOS. 7% of iPhones released in the last four years run iOS 12, and 2% run an earlier version of iOS. If one had to compare this with OS updates then Apple continues to be way ahead of competition. Google has stopped releasing its Android distribution numbers and hasn't done so in almost a year now. But Android 10, Google's last big OS update, won't have the reach as Apple's OS does. This is also down to the fact that OEMs are relatively slow in updating their smartphones to the latest OS updates. So even if users want to get onto the latest Android version they have to wait till it officially is rolled out by brands. iPhone users are more than keen to upgrade to latest OS updates and the numbers back that assumption. Even those who have older iPhones run the latest OS update available. 81% of iPhones that were released more than 4 years ago have iOS 13 running on them. About 13% have iOS 12 whereas just 6% of iPhone users have an earlier version of iOS. The numbers are equally encouraging for users as 93% of iPads released in the last 4 years have iPadOS running. Just 5% of iPad users have an upgraded to iPadOS and continue to use iOS 12 whereas just 1% of users have an earlier version of iOS. Taking into account on iPad users, 73% have iPadOS running, to view the full article. Click the first link in the description below.